Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. I have a story to tell you about when I first got to this park um, mid-morning. Two large birds were circling overhead that I mistook for ravens. And first I started with the raven salutation, which is like this. Raven! Strong raven! Brave raven! Good raven! Which is what I usually say to get things rolling, you know. And I got halfway through the raven salutation, and then I realized they were turkey vultures, which uh, feed on carrion. They feed on dead animals. They're scavengers. And so then I said, like this, Raven! This is how I started. Brave Raven! Strong ra oh, oh Turkey vultures! <laughs> turkey vultures! <laughs> And so I was very embarrassed that I made that mistake because the difference between them is very clear. So I was looking down and feeling embarrassed and then I heard the, my very first ever word from one of those two circling turkey vultures. And it took me a moment to register it. I was so surprised. It sounded like this from far off up above. Turkey vulture. A lot like that. Keeping in mind that the two high notes are exactly the same height. It's not like the songbirds, which then said, in re repeating it to me, because they were amused at my, my feeling of embarrassment, they said, turkey vulture. This is songbird, but the turkey vultures had said, turkey vulture. Do you see the difference? A difference of intonation. I was mulling all this over because the first encounter is always very cool. I could not get those vultures to say that one more time. They just went off. So I talked to the songbirds. I said they're very talkative songbirds that speak English here at, at the entrance to Charmley uh, Trail overlooking the Pacific Ocean. They're very talkative. They must have been talking with the ranger or the hikers. Their, their English skills are impressive. There's a tribe of them here that do that. I was hoping to get their attentions because I haven't been talked to by songbirds for a long time. And so I said, why won't the turkey vultures talk? And they said, repeat, repeat, too many times. They implied they don't like that. So uh, it's easy to get on a turkey vultures nerves. I'd say they're rather taciturn birds. They don't like talking much. That's my feeling. Here's one more adventure. I was going on a little farther and I heard a rasping sound. I thought maybe it was a fox off in the bush on the side there, right? I immediately noticed it was something brand new for me. So I asked, what was that? There was a scrub jay nearby and it thought that was amazingly funny and it started imitating the same sound, that rasping sound, only in a slightly different nasal variant. And it, every time it pretended to be that other wild being, I, I started to laugh and it must have happened five or six times it would say it and I would laugh. And finally I just gave up and walked on. Uh, it was pretty funny. Uh, I guess I'll never know what made that sound. <laughs> That's all for now. God bless you all and keep you safe and be with you through all your days. In love, light, and joy, this is Alice B. Claggett. I am of the stars overlooking the blue Pacific, and so are you. Come and visit me at my wonderful world-class WordPress website, Awakening with Planet Earth. HTTPS colon slash slash awakeningwithplanetearth.com.